Hey friends, Ryan Dorn here, your global sales coach. Hope you're having a good week out there in sales land. I just got a couple contracts in. Pretty excited about that. Rolling in to the new year with all kinds of great stuff straight ahead. All right, our tip for today. Are you working as hard to keep the business as you did to get the business? For the most part, I would say the folks that I coach and work with, the answer is no. Let's think about this for a second. If it takes you four or five hours which is probably low, to get a meeting with somebody, another four or five hours, which is probably low, to close the deal, that's eight total hours. After you make that sale, do you spend eight hours, not in customer service now, eight hours in retention-based activities, thanking that client, writing handwritten thank you notes, send them a $5 Starbucks card, remember when their birthday is, things like that. Do you spend a serious amount of time? For the most part, I find the answer is not really or you're waiting on your company to do it. Remember friends, you are 60 to 70% more likely to renew or to retain a client. You're only about five, 10, 15, maybe 20, 25% likely to sell somebody brand new unless you're out there discounting, which I'm hoping you're not doing. So think about it friends. It's easier to retain customers than to get new ones. So what is your client retention strategy. I share with you some of my ideas and I'd encourage you to get out there and really own the retention piece of your sales process. Don't forget, if this job was easy, if sales was easy, everybody would be doing it. And they're not. We're we're a little crazy. I get it. But we really are the chosen few. We found this great career in sales that'll feed our families for a lifetime. All right, friends, we'll see you next week. And if I can be of help to you training your team, speaking at your sales conference, reach out to me over at ryandorn.com, D-O-H-R-N. All right, see you next week.